So what I'm gonna do this time, I'm gonna land this plane the other way. So I'm gonna land on runway 12. Uh, which is, you know, going now west, right? 27, 270, right? So, we will need to do 180 degree turn and uh, go towards, uh, what, 12. So I'm gonna go into the sea a bit. Okay, maybe I'm going too much to the south. All right. Now I'm gonna do some changes here. So I'm gonna reduce throttle, but I'm gonna put full pitch because then the brain is more controllable. And I'm gonna turn gently, not to cause any stalls. Okay. I'm gonna turn, hopefully not losing any altitude too much. A lot throttle. Okay. The airstrip is on our well, in front of us, but it's not aligned, so I'm going to go a little bit to the left first. Beautiful mountains, but we don't have now. I need to focus on uh, trying to get the plane into right alignment with the strip. Now the gear needs to go out. Okay. I need to turn into the strip. Should be fine with this. Okay. We have more power maybe. Flaps. Okay, speed needs to be 150. So we still feel fast. Okay, let's point at the zebra. Zebra. Okay, zebra is in front of us, everything is perfect. And, yay! Gentle, gentle, gentle. Not too high with the nose. Perfect. Exit B will be ideal, but we will take the next one. Not this, this one, I don't actually know what to do with this one. This one's kind of weird. I'll take Delta. <laughs> Okay, I'll take Delta, reduce the um, RPM so that we have more thrust uh, from lower RPM. But uh, yeah, just slowly. So I'm just going on low RPM now. Just cruising into the, you know, taxiway. Right, the so landing was pretty neat. Um, try to do it really, really, you know, all in the right place. Good speed, uh, good angle of approach, good altitude. Aiming at zebra, trying to touch before the first of those. Uh, parallel strips, we have like several of those strips uh, like after zebra you have like single single strips I think repeated a few times for or something like this so I tried to touch before first to make it really nice touch down Yeah, we're going, we're going, not to worry. We're going here. Okay. That's where we need to go, because... Yeah. I have checked earlier the layout of this runway, and the, the apron is... You know, the 
apron is somewhere here. So I need to go that way. Actually show maybe if we are stable. Are we stable? Um, can I show? Is it possible? I don't wanna crash into grass. <laughs> well it don't be a crash but I mean let's make sure the plane is going in a direction that we you see this this is Stoyanka, so we're going all the way here and then we turn. So we're doing pretty well. It's pretty cool, no? I try to be in this middle. So, okay. okay. As they say, aviate and then take photos. Right. So flaps can go up. We don't need them anymore. Uh, I have changed where I have my trim. I have this small wheel on my main yoke, just below the hat. I used to use it for zoom. That's my. I must say that I started using the different. I started using uh, this for zooming, and for controlling of the view. It's much more, uh, in all airplanes I just use this one because then I can use my hat for, uh, you know, as a trim hat in other planes. In, in jets you have a trim hat on the yoke, so i using my, my hat on the yoke as a trim hat. I'm gonna take this one here. But in this plane there is no trim hat, there is one trim wheel that is just for the uh, um, it's just for oh, 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 oh. okay. Stop, stop, stop. Perfect. Now we need to rotate the like, like thirty-five is what we want for a moment. Parking brake. Okay, let's look around. What we're gonna do? One, two, three, four, five, six. I'm not sure is it five, six or. Oh. Four, five, four. What's this one? Landing gear indicator lights. Inverter. Okay. And this one's. That's another circuit breaker. Huh. Not sure if I remember correctly, but I'm trying to follow the procedure that uh, another guy from that actually flies really active to was testing this um, simulated one. So, turn this off now. I think he did it this way, kind of. Okay, cool. And that's it. We finished flying for this, this moment of time. All right, thank you for watching and. Yeah, we're gonna take a photo. And that's it. The settings, this is the settings. The resolution is 6000 by 1440, three screen projection. It's dual display. Uh, this display is 34 inches HDR display. This one is 27 inches HDR display. This video is recorded in HDR 10 bit per channel. Um, I will try to produce HDR for YouTube, but I think I'm going to upload the standard SDR because I'm always having difficulty making YouTube accept HDR. So, thank you.